up friends good morning it is 509 a.m. So I'm currently on pediatrics. Do I have to be waking up this early? No. It's just nice to have this time in the morning uninterrupted. Nothing to do but study or prepare for the day. So that's the way I like to do it. For me, it just works better that way. Time to work. Wednesday, Ugh, a little after five. Ugh, I got rocked with my TBL yesterday, but it's okay because I think it lit a fire under me and I'm determined to get some practice questions in today and, and get some studying done even while I'm at the hospital because there is downtime. I just haven't been using it very well. So we'll see. While I'm at the hospital, I don't like to do any studying because I just want to help the team. But if I'm being honest, sometimes they're just like doing their own thing. So I should try to use that time to get a few flashcards in, read an Amboss article, something, you know? <sighs> Hello friends, I'm back. It was a full day at the hospital, but I am home earlier than I've been in a while. So it's 418, the sun is still out. It's going down, but it's still out. So that's a win in my book. Please ignore the Yuffie in the background. It's cleaning because I can't take care of myself. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm first gonna try to finish a few Anki cards that I have. I've been trying to use Anki again. Again with Anki, I don't know. Well, actually, I don't think you guys know about my phases of anki but I'm trying to use Anki for peace just to see if it helps me. I don't have a crazy number of Anki cards to do every day, but I am trying to incorporate it into my studying. I feel like it's the first time in a while that I haven't had to prep for like a presentation or something. So I think I'll actually get some practice questions done tonight, but we will see. I wanna bring you guys into the hospital so you can see what it's like, but there just isn't a good place or time to be filming. Basically what I do every day is I show up at the hospital sometime before 7 a.m. We get morning sign out from the people who were overnight, the night team at 7 a.m. So I usually arrive to the hospital around 6.30. 6.45 actually, 6.45. Hey Ponce, do you wanna say hi to the vlog? Hi vlog. So I get morning sign out at 7 a.m. And then we'll pre-round with just the residents. Then we will present to the attendings and then we'll round together with the attendings. And this has actually been a super long process recently. It takes a couple of hours. So usually we're rounding the moment we finish sign out. Finishing sign out usually is around 7.45 until like 11.45. And then at 12, be working on whatever random things, orders, notes, lab, following up on things ordering consults, yada, yada, yada. And I'm just trying to help in any way that I can as a medical student because I'm not equipped to like place orders for patients. There's usually a couple of teaching opportunities or opportunities for me to teach on a subject, which is something my residents really like for me to do. So I've taught on C-reactive protein, its utility as a lab value. A longer presentation today on asthma, which is like the bread and butter of pediatrics. That's really it. For the rest of the day, I'm gonna quickly get my Anki done. Then I'm gonna get my workout on. And then let me get some more studying in because I feel like I haven't had the time to study. I think we're doing okay, right Pons? Pons thinks we're doing okay. minute spin. It's fine. Better than nothing. Back to the grind. Good morning, friends. Let me adjust you. I hope you guys are enjoying the vlog so far up to this point. If you are, please give it a thumbs up because it really helps my channel. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Hello. It is 5.02 a.m. and I am sitting at my desk, which means I'm doing pretty good for my schedule. Pons is all up in my camera. Pons, don't show the camera your butt. I need to find a way to get more practice questions in for sure.
the hospital. I was carrying a surgical patient who was recovering well. There really wasn't much for us to do, so they let us out at four o'clock. It's now 4.30, I'm home. And I think since it's still daylight, I might have just enough energy to get a workout in. So we're gonna try again. And then cooking dinner. Oh, actually, I think I have leftovers. Not cooking dinner then. Do some practice questions, because I told myself I would do practice questions. And puns! All right, bye guys. Stuck in the past watching videos of us I have been trying to get rid of your stuff But voices in my head are telling me to stop It's all I have left, all I have of you Thought I was more than a body to hold, baby I wanted you, wanted us to look. be something I was Back so sure Let my guard down for you Baby, why'd you have to love me, love me like that? I gave you my heart and you tore it apart Don't know why you had to hurt me, hurt me like that Cause now I'm messed up, drinking non-stop Happy freaking Friday guys. We've made it. Um, it's basically the end of the week because I actually don't work tomorrow. So I have tomorrow off, although I do work on Sunday. Tear. It was a little more challenging to get out of bed this morning, I'm not gonna lie to you. And I also was kind of bad and I slept on the couch. <sighs> I've got my coffee. Today is actually one of my last days on inpatient peds at this hospital. Oh my god, I have my pisapelo still in. Well, that now I look worse. Do you know what a pisapelo is? If you do, leave it in the comment down below. Anyway, I need to study, so I'm gonna go study now. How do I look? Do I look busted, dusted, crusted, a little red? Damn. It's okay, Friday. Try to sleep in tomorrow. Bye guys, talk to you soon. Baby, why'd you have to love me, love me like that? I gave you my heart and you tore it apart. Don't know why you had to hurt me, hurt me like that. Cause now I'm messed up, drinking non-stop. Just trying to forget you and everything we said. But I can't seem to get these thoughts out of my head. to the hospital. I feel like every time I sit down to study, one, I'm actually really enjoying studying. Like obviously, I don't always wanna study, you know? Like, come on. There are obviously times when I'm like, ugh, I don't really wanna study. But those times are kind of few and far between these days, especially once I get started. So maybe it's because everything I'm learning is actually being tested in ways that feel more applicable, whether that's when I'm with an attending or a resident and they ask me a question about intussusception. Inter into susception. It just feels like more important. It's not like preclinical where you're just kind of studying and studying and you don't really have any context for studying. You do have context, but it's not quite like a clinical setting. So it's just different now. And I had been putting off doing practice questions for so long, to be honest, and I, I regret it already because I'm learning so much just by getting all these practice questions wrong. But the point is, I'm having a better time studying. Of course, I don't always feel like studying, but lately I've been kind of in the mood. So I'm gonna ride that out because when you have that energy, you just gotta go with it. Who am I? Ugh. Yesterday wasn't super busy, so I'm hoping today we get some more patients. We also right now kind of have a mystery patient. Not a total mystery, but like actually kind of a total mystery. Hopefully we've made some progress. It's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be a good day. Mm, 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 mm. That beat was so whack, I'm gonna stop. I've been wearing these Crocs my sister got me, which are mad, mad comfortable. I've never been a Crocs person, but she got me these posties, which are like, supposed to be a special kind of Croc. I bought these sneakers. Look at how cute these are. Are you focusing on the sneaker? I can't tell. I think they're so cute. They are the New Balance 574s. Get yourself a pair if you want. Oh, these are comfortable. Pons, you gotta let me put my shoes on, homie. Hot. How do they look? Ooh, fleeky. Yeah, that's enough of that. It's time to go. I'm actually 
freaking exhausted. I got home an hour ago. Thank God it's Friday. And I actually was supposed to work tomorrow, but one of my classmates wanted to switch, so I have tomorrow off, and I am feeling so freaking grateful. Although that will mean I'll work Sunday to Friday next week. And, uh, Oh, hi, Pons. Say hello. I might just go straight to bed. Uh, the hospital was good. My patient did not get cleared. I think I'm gonna close this vlog here because that's it. That's a week of me on Impatient Peds. Love you guys. If you like this one, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It really does help my channel. I appreciate you guys so much for sticking with me. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and uh, I will see you guys real soon. Pons, you wanna say bye? Say bye, Pons. Bye, guys. The same like strangers again.